Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This ultrasound video shows intestinal obstruction with dilated gut loops and presence of free fluid in between the gut loops. You can see the scanning of the gut loops in the upper abdomen and you can see the con gut contents are moving to and fro and not passing forwards smoothly. and gut loops are dilated. You can see the diameter of the dilated gut loops is almost 3 cm. Now you can see the free fluid in between the gut loops. This is the presence of free fluid and this is very important to see the free fluid. It has greater importance in diagnosing the severity of the intestinal obstruction. You can see the gut loops are dilated and intestinal movements are sluggish but the contents in the intestine are moving to and fro. This is the free fluid in between the gut loops. Now you can see the gut loops and the lower abdominal cavity. You can see the urinary bladder, gut loops and the free fluid in, the, in between the gut loops. In patients with small bowel obstruction, spine view show dilatation of the multiple loops of small bowel with the opacity of air in the large bowel. These findings in conjunction with the lack of air and stool in the distal colon and rectum are highly suggestive of mechanical intestinal obstruction. The relevance of free fluid between intestinal loops detected by sonography in the clinical assessment of small bowel Obstruction in adults is very important to judge the severity of the condition. The presence of large amount of fluid between dilated gut loops suggests worsening of mechanical small bowel obstruction that requires not a medical therapy but immediate surgery. Obstruction of the large bowel usually causes milder symptoms that develop more gradually than those caused by small bowel obstruction. Increasing constipation leads to obstipation and abdominal distension. Vomiting may occur usually several hours after the sunset of other symptoms. Now again you can see the gut loops in the lower abdominal cavity with dilated gut loops. Constipation is a medical condition that can affect your ability to eliminate stool. Obstipation is different from constipation in that obst obstipation is when a person cannot pass stool or gas usually due to obstruction or blockage of hard difficult to pass stool. Again you can see the dilated gut loops in the lower abdominal cavity and a, sig a significant amount of fluid is seen, free fluid is seen in between the gut loops. The high fiber content in banana can help normalize the effect of constipation. They can help you to push out the waste better by making stools easier to pass.
again you can see the gut contents are moving to and fro due to the obstruction they cannot pass smoothly inside the gut loops that are dilated fluid is seen in between the gut loops the normal diameter of the gut loops maximum is 25 mm in adults in this case it is almost 3 cm 30 mm you can see the obstruction thanks for watching please subscribe my channel if you do like this video please click the like button and see the important important information in the description of this video thanks